So this was in support of IND 288, The Art of Steve Prince, which is the Center for Integrative Learning's first kickoff class. And we brought in Steve Prince as a way to begin to do cross-disciplinary work. This community project that I created is called Urban Garden, where I'm engaging students in the creation of a piece that didn't exist until we started it that's metaphorically looking at America as a giant garden. And then we're looking at it from the idea of looking at those problematic elements that are embedded within that garden, but also looking at it from the standpoint of those elements that are wholesome and are lively within that garden. And so we are actually constructing it as a drawing um, and as a community event. This week I was able to come into the studio and you just sort of think about uh, the things that you enjoy the things that you feel needs work in society and you just start to draw. If we confront those issues or we confront that hurt, that pain that's embedded within America's soil, then I believe that there's a triumph that comes on the other side of that. The most important part of this project is not the product, it's the process. He made me feel like I could sort of use my creativity even though I don't see myself as a creative person and that made me more open to actually want to contribute and I have to say I've been here every day for like literally the whole week sort of like adding on to my piece. Everyone has a particular lens on which they look at the world and how they receive it and how can we become more sensitive to that and embrace each other. Hopefully it will go beyond just us making these elements on the wall but move into growing a deeper sensitivity for each other but also spurring us all to action. Today was just the culmination to watch uh, a visual artist in conversation with musical artists and to watch uh, Herb Smith communicate with his band just through their eyes was an amazing thing and it really is integrative learning at its peak. On one level a student can come in here and be intimidated by the artwork because they feel that they don't have the skill level to do it. But then another level, the student can feel like, hey, everybody's in here working, and there's all different kinds of skill levels on this wall. You're all part of the garden, and your voice is important. Your voice is important.